Hey guys, Alex from Online Tarot is here with your monthly numerology and this video is for life path or character number 7. It will be a tarot reading um, based on your life path or character number. If you don't know how to calculate it, I will leave a link down below to the video where I explain how to do it. Or you can just Google, it's really really easy to calculate. So it will be your November forecast. Uh, we have your general information the main theme of the month here with some oracle cards to clarify it when i was pulling the cards for you a half of deck jumped out kind of so i think we will have to clarify for you sevens and also we have your love money and changes that are coming to you in november 2020 so let's start but before that the usual reminder if i did that already please forgive me it's still a general reading please treat it as such okay let's see See, 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 see. Ooh. Oh, interesting. We have Ten of Wands, Ace of Pentacles, King of Cups, and another Ten of Cups. Two Tens and the Ace. Those, that's why we have so many cards jumping out for you. But you had this energy of the new beginning last time. So, also, we have Practice Compassion, Be Supportive. And uh, act as if your partner is here. But, 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 let's see, one second. So, okay, yeah. Or, okay, guys. Um, so, November seems to be the month of relationships, interpersonal relationships. It's romance or not romance, friendship, family issues, so many things that are... Uh, we will be focusing on for every number it's relationships and love or the focus of November 2020 so uh, again for most of you who if you are married it feels like there may be some difficulties if you're married if uh, you are in a committed relationship there may be some difficulties you do value this connection a lot but there are some difficulties with the ten of cups and the ten of ten of wands but it feels like commitment is the equals heaviness and problems for you right now and there is kind of somebody else and again and again we're coming it coming to this energy so it feels like your family needs you i don't know so it may be it's not necessarily um your spouse but maybe your your parents or your siblings or people who you consider your family so it feels like you uh you are needed by family in november you're going to be needed but also you your focus or your heart will be elsewhere either you're meeting somebody new or you are reaching out to somebody um who you've been thinking about a lot we, we saw it for you within the last two years now almost two years so with this practice compassion and be supportive it seems like yeah somebody in your family close people they do need you and please don't don't be consumed 100 percent by this new feeling or maybe it's not new or revival of some old feelings mm. And for some of you, you are meeting the person, your future partner, or um, the love of your life, or somebody you've been missing for a really long time, and you've been kind of looking at them from the distance, wanting them, wanting to talk to them. You're reaching out, they're reaching out. It's very, it feels like they. it's a bit separate. I'm going to draw some more cards for you right now, number seven. Um, but there will be definitely matters of heart. For some of you, if you're dealing with an ex-spouse, please be supportive. I mean, I don't know what your situation is. I'm not telling you to support a toxic person or somebody who was very um, not good. Or, but um, somebody definitely need your understanding. And it will be difficult for you to balance that. You may also feel like... Um, you are the one who has the weight of the world on your shoulders. Like you have to deal with every, everything. Well, all you want is just to dance in the rain because you're, you're happy and you're in love. It's like whatever is happening. Yeah, this, this theme of... 
pure joy and pure emotions uh, will will be overshadowing everything else. While you will have um, some family issues to heal for sure. The justice. But in November you're going to feel like, you know what? It's just me time. It's just my time. But yeah, totally. I'm not telling you to forget about it at all. But just remember that somebody close to you needs your attention too so give them some 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 of it mm -hmm, the lovers and the three of wands here ten of swords another ten interesting so you are definitely in between of something that's coming to an end or maybe somebody's going through mm, some difficult times in, around you. But again, all you will be willing to do is be in love with this person. So you may be a bit torn between your family, maybe dealing with an ex-spouse and already either meeting the new person or reaching out to somebody you think is your soulmate. Wow, number seven. So many things. If you are not separating if you are uh, in a solid relationship there will be some issues that you're gonna need to heal because um, you will be bringing this new life and you will be choosing between uh, how to say focusing on the negativity or focusing on different aspects of this relationship that can be I don't know opened in the future so it will be also a choice but most of you will be choosing love okay let's see more about love okay okay so yeah you kind of you kind of will be stuck your mind and your heart will be stuck on uh, on love so again if you are in a relationship healing relationship issues uh, in a solid relationship for for others it's like a reconciliation or meeting uh someone you are going or you already consider your soulmate and november will be the beginning of the changes of the changes season it will be only the beginning mm -hmm. with the hangman it's something something that has been stuck for so long another 10 will start changing and for some of you this is this uh, again being between a relationship that ended recently and a new one but it's much better energy guys much better energy though you are still in between because most probably you you I don't know dealing with custody battles or just the custody of kids or it's a person you respect still and there's somebody new who inspires you um, it's difficult it's difficult and it's something long-term but your energy is getting better and better anyway so what about your finances we have seven of cups two of pentacles and the fool mm -hmm. again th this energy of just just I want to be just free I just want to be free and in love and nothing like this will be also um, distracting you from uh, uh, figuring your things with your job again you either have um, you're either thinking about starting your own business or um, there are some some issues that you need to solve with your business you need to be really smart with your job and finances at the moment but you will be distracted for sure so mind 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 uh, that and uh, be aware of that so you need to try and keep your cool together to, uh, in regards to your money and finances let's see what about changes something hidden okay then we have the queen of cups the tower and the seven of swords again something hidden it's um either something hidden comes to to light 
suddenly again it may be a person reaching out to you this person that you've been obsessing with or you reaching out to them and you will be totally just with the four of pentacles you will be obsessed with this person and you will do everything to to uh keep them in your life to hold on to them it seems but it feels like it's either hidden or a forbidden connection something um that you're afraid to be judged for but again there's no controlling anymore it's getting out of control and it will be difficult for you to to think or focus on anything else um, but this love well number seven so interesting let me know uh if it resonates with you please remember if it's not your message it's simply not your message and if you liked or disliked the video you know what to do and if you're in need of a personal reading and you want to have one with me the information how to get it is down below in the description box okay have a great day and talk to you soon